welcome back in this video we're going to look at more common views that we use in our Android project the view that we're going to begin with we're going to look at the text view so text view simply write text view and then I can give it maybe width match parent or wrap content and also give the height wrap content and then what it takes it takes the what the text okay so remember I created the about me string so I can simply put about me string here and then all the information uh, about me you see all the information that I put in the about me string it will come here so this text view has some other interesting thing that it takes such as the font size or the, the text size by simply typing size and then you'll be able to see the what the text size and uh, you can specify and uh, the most uh, preferable well specifying unit is using the what the DP you can even make it maybe 26 and then to become what 26 we can make it 25 then this text size will become 25 another attribute that you can put here is the is the color of this text by simply putting color and then you can specify the what the color maybe using the android colors and maybe say red so this color will be red so i can close this one here at this point i can give the padding and the margin those ones are already common everyone knows them let me, let me create another text view so these one are, play, are being placed in what in a horizontal way because because our orientation is what is vertical so i'm going to create another view and uh, i'll wrap it i mean I'll, I'll make it much parent for example much parent and then uh, i'm going to put here the height to be wrap content okay then I'm going to increase its size by simply putting size and uh, maybe make it 20, 20 what? 20 dp, the text size. So I have that. Uh, now I have to put the text. Maybe I want to put the word uh, call. Oh, play. Okay, call. So, to, okay, call. So to put call, I just simply put text itself and I type here. Maybe call manually by myself. I can change the color to the real black for example by simply putting color uh, color to what to Android black and then I can also increase uh, increase its padding by by margin by its margin or padding any that I want by simply putting the what the padding and then I specify the padding that I want for example 15 dp then you see that the text content has been uh, included inside by 15 dp so something more that i wanted to show you that is rare that people only don't always use is the what is the text box drawable or using the image for this text so to do that you just simply write it drawable and you see different uh, places where you can place drawable can you see you have drawable padding then have drawable left, drawable right, drawable right, where is it, drawable right, drawable right, drawable left, drawable start and drawable bottom. So that one it means that we can include the drawable just in the same field of our, I mean in the same uh, element of our text. For example, if I want to include this drawable of call in, on the left here, I'll just put simply a drawable uh, left then i'll have to specify which drawable i want which is ic call when i put this one you see a drawable or an image will be included inside our heart inside our uh i mean next to our text call i can uh, increase on the padding between this drawable and this one by simply using a uh, drawable padding so if i put drawable padding it will be the difference between the drawable that i have used and the what and the element that i'm implementing i mean the, the content that is inside the what the text so if i put for example uh 10 uh 10 dp 10 dp you can see here it has been increased the space between the call and the text it has been what it has been increased okay so i can as well for example let me create one more i can as well duplicate this one here then i have the second one then i come and create another vector image uh for example by simply right clicking here then come to vectors and then uh double click to get another vector and then i can select another vector maybe you see here there's a mystical vector 
uh, let me call it let me copy it by just simply clicking on ok then i'll come and uh, delete this let me say ok copy this and say ok and then after i say finish so instead of having uh, you see here one drawable has been created called it is called call mist so i want this one to also be call mist so how do you do by simply changing this one to call mist then it will be call mist i can change also the code the content by saying mist calls okay so by doing that you shall have used the drawable in the same text view you see a drawable is in the same field with the word with the text view and that one can make the life more simple by not writing multiple text by not multi writing the multiple views just to represent an icon of a what of a certain text view